So internet, it looks like you'd like to learn more about the processor on your motherboard. Well, let's check it out. Now, your processor is simply the brain or your central processing unit or CPU of your computer. So everything is going to be going through that processor. And it's really like the biggest bottleneck if it's one of your slowest components. Now, the processor always has a heat sink and a fan on it because the, hot, the processor gets really hot and heats up and needs to be cooled adequately. Now, there's two main types of processors out there, or processor manufacturers you have to choose from when buying a processor, and that is AMD and Intel. Now, as well as that, there's also 32-bit processors and 64-bit processors. Now, one of the coolest things about looking at our processor on our motherboard is the fact that we can tell what type of socket we have so we can install a new processor or something of that sort. So, let's take a look. Now, this processor here is... Take a look at this guy up top here, a socket 941. So if I were to look at another processor to replace this one, it would have to be a socket 941. And I would insert that via zero insertion force because once I pull this heatsink off, the processor, the old one, I flip up the lever, the processor would come right off, the new one, drop right in, latch it down, put on some new thermal paste, clear off the old thermal paste, and you're good to go. So, just one thing, another thing to take note of is your processor speed, like I said, it's, it's really, it's the brains and the bulk of your computer. It really sets the pace, one may say, of your computer. All right, now remember, just click on one of the items on the motherboard to learn more information about that item. And like always guys, if you have a request from me, just send it on over to requests at mahalo.com.